okay sorry guys disregard my last video this is my real video um so i looked up virtual reality it's a computer simulation where people can interact with artificial objects in an artificial environment um, can be used with goggles or gloves with sensors on them it can allow people to have experiences that they may um, never have had without it it can give people the opportunity to um, experience an imaginary world um, like it's real. Um, VR can be used in medicine, military, agriculture, schooling. Um, it uses two senses, hearing and vision. It's said to be the technology of the future. Um, the title of my article is called Virtual Reality in Medicine. A brief overview in re future research directions. So in this article they kind of talked about the different applications of virtual reality in medicine. Um, they specifically talked about it in psychiatry along with um, in aspects of rehabilitation along with some um, some future directions that it can go. The article mentions that it predicts um, that VR will be the number one technology for training surgeons in the future, which is pretty cool to think about. So a direct quote from the article that I really enjoyed. Whatever limits the real world imposes on us, the virtual world is its ideal unlimited reflection and creates a space where the impossible becomes possible, which I thought was pretty good. And then relating the article to the readings, um, I guess I was thinking about surgeries on the heart or the lungs or um, on the throat. Um, it talked about how virtual reality could one day be associated with um, robots performing surgeries um, using aspects of virtual reality to get us um, that far in technology. Um, along with, uh, I read about uh, hyperventilation, hypoventilation. Um, if somebody's in the hospital um, having a panic attack, hyperventilating, maybe using um, virtual reality to maybe calm them down, you know, get them out of this scary hospital to get them in a world that, um, a, a different world um, using these virtual reality um, goggles. I thought about, you know, kind of piggybacking off that. Um, kids in getting IVs, IV therapy, um, in chapter 40 talked about that. Um, kids with chemotherapy, you know, using virtual reality to get out of the hospital and out of this treatment and going to a different world. Um, so kind of using virtual reality um, in that aspect as well. Um, okay, thank you.